Hello, my name is Charles Shear and I'm a senior undergraduate at Florida Atlantic University studying biology and chemistry. I really enjoy these two subjects because they intertwine and give me a broader perspective of the world around me and also they apply to my research. I am currently doing research in Dr. Stefan Roche's lab at the chemistry department at FAU and I really enjoy the lab because it really goes into organic chemistry with an application of biological sciences. Currently, I am doing research there, but I'm here to present to you the research that I've been doing over the summer during the SURF program at FAU or Florida University. My summer research at FAU during the SURF program involved designing and synthesizing molecules that can potentially target tubulin proteins in cancer cells. These tubulin proteins are very important because they polymerize together to create a protofilament that can eventually separate chromosomes and allow the cell to go through cellular division. And so our objective or our project is to modify a chemotype called 4-azopolyphilotoxin, which is a known molecule that can bind tubulin and disrupt this whole cellular division and modify it so that we can increase its cellular biological activity. All right, so there are two modifications that we're going to do for this project. One modification, or the first modification, is a um, lactone conversion to a thiolactone ring. And the second modification is an alkylamine substitution with a hydrogen on the chemotype. So the first modification, we started off with looking at a previous, previously constructed library of molecules that someone in my lab has synthesized. And so we took the six best molecules from that library that had different array of different substitutions on the chemotype and we looked at the IC50s or the biologic activity of these compounds with THP1 cell lines. We chose um, compounds with a scale of 7 nanomolars to 19 nanomolars of IC50s with THP1 cell lines and we used the same synthesis that we did to synthesize the previously constructed molecules called the Husson 3 cr So we were able to successfully synthesize these molecules, these uh, molecules with a thiolactone ring, and we are going to be sending them out to our collaborators for a THP1 cell line testing. And so at the end, we will compare the new data with the IC50s with the old library of molecules and compare to see if this modification uh, increased the cell uh, biological activity of our molecule and proteins. The second modification is substituting the alkylamine with the hydrogen on the chemotype, and this part of the part of the project is focusing on the different interactions with the pr in, the, in the protein itself. And so we want to create different structures, uh, different chains, so that we can potentially target the different parts of the protein. And so we are in progress with that right now, but eventually we will send these compounds out to our collaborators for THP1 cell testing and then um, see if we can increase um, the amount of chains that we can potentially substitute on the compound or decrease.